Evening everybody, it is 25 past 6 and I'm starting a vlog because you know what, I'm mad. But basically it's Friday, thank heaven, the weekend and I've got a really nice weekend planned. Um, and basically, I'm going to place you there. Um, I have still got my Primark bag from last weekend when I was with Malika to unpack because I wanted to vlog it because of my organisational perks to it. And also there's stuff in there that I want to put in certain drawers and I want to show you. And I've had like a massive makeup purge, declutter, sort through. It's probably one of my biggest declutters I've ever done, like ever. And I know I said that before, but this is literally the biggest one I've ever, ever, ever done. I was so cutthroat. I got rid of so much, um, which went to my colleague and she was greatly appreciative. Um, so now I've got a drawer free, which means I can make an everyday makeup drawer. So then more products are used. And I wanted to vlog me creating this drawer because it will chop and change. And I want to film a makeup collection soon because I've done my declutter um so yeah and i wanted to do this because i've now got loads of storage on my phone because i uploaded my makeup declutter i'm onto private already so yeah but that is the plan i have no idea what we're having for dinner um but i really just want to organize and sort my stuff out really um just saying i don't think i've mentioned this in the video yet but i wanted to now i am obsessed obsessed with riverdale oh my god i am so late to things so late i was late to pretty little liars i was late to the vampire diaries and i'm late to riverdale but I, there's three seasons two complete ones which i'm sure you all know and then one that's just started and episodes are released every thursday so i'm really happy about that and um i watched season one and season two and the first episode of season three which was amazing by the way in three days three days which is pretty shameful but it was amazing it's just so good it's so similar to pretty little liars i'm not going to give spoilers like or names or anything but at the beginning there's like a death and then that unravels loads of secrets and like a massive plot twist cole sprouse is in it lily reinhardt like please and thank you like i'm just obsessed i'm just obsessed and i just can't wait to watch the rest of season three because i cannot explain the amount of moments i've had it was i just there were so many things i was not expecting like the black hood what the hell if you've watched it don't leave any spoilers season three's like pilot it's like what the hell i'm just watching it like but it's good would i recommend it yes am i going to stop rambling now yes the contents of the primark bag um my primark haul would have been up by the time you see this so i'm not giving any spoilers unless you haven't watched it and if you haven't it'll be linked in the description but i've got my other stuff that i brought in london here in here as well and i'm just gonna organize it and this organizer is going to be the savior to my life because this is what's going to be in my everyday makeup drawer um and i'll do like an overview of how it looks but i'll be doing an update to makeup collection very very soon my first drawer which if you've watched my previous makeup collections looks a bit like this which is my base drawer um with foundations concealers and all of that fun stuff this is gonna be my everyday makeup drawer now don't get me wrong i like how it looks and i'm hoping to fit an everyday makeup drawer if i really don't like it then i won't um but i just think it will help me use my makeup products and then decide whether i want to use like keep them or not and then i can declutter like as i go a bit more like i do a lot of declutters don't get me wrong if i didn't i wouldn't be able to fit everything in the this drawer um and I do want to get another set of Alex 9 drawers, but preferably not for makeup, because I think that'd be a bit insane for me. This drawer as well has had a massive clear out. Like, you can see that. Like, it's crazy. Um, so, yeah. And I'm thinking if I can get another of my acrylic organisers from Primark, then I can put them in pretty much all my makeup drawers. Hey, pretty baby, it's my in your
I've also randomly decided to declutter my makeup brushes because a dream of mine is to pretty much have all eye brushes from Spectrum because I love their brushes, their brush quality is amazing. Obviously I'll keep some of my holy grail status brushes but you know. Um, but these ones are getting chucked um, because they're just so grim. I need to be better at cleaning my brushes but some of these are so old as well, some of them are cheap, some of them are not so cheap by real techniques but they're well past their sell by date. Um, and then these are the brushes that I've given a quick spring clean to that can go to my colleagues. Brushes that I don't use and it's like makeup, there's no point having brushes that you don't use. The majority of these are eye brushes because I buy eye brushes a lot more than I buy face brushes. But I've got like this Primark angle brush and it's really nice, it's so fluffy and it's perfect for packing on contour or bronzer. Um, but I like my Revolution one, so you know, and this is a Real Techniques one that I got in the Boxing Day sales last year. And it's just like a fibre brush and i never use it so it could go to my colleague i have organized these two drawers this drawer i did the other day and this drawer has just got like mascaras potted products eye primer that sort of thing and i'm really glad i'm using them properly for makeup but honestly my makeup collection looks a bit weird for me um but i will get used to it i know because i think it's just so much better so this is what my everyday makeup drawers looking like i really like it I haven't found anything to put in this compartment or this one. Actually, yes, I have. I've got, I wanted to put my Lush Bubblegum Lip Scrub in there because it's just something I use on the daily anyway. Um, so I've just got to find something to put in here, um, which actually could be thinking about it. i put that in there to organise it better. Could it be that? Oh. Oh, it fits like a glove. Yeah, okay, that's a sign. Okay, so this is how it's looking. Um, I'm really, really happy with it. So I've just got my foundation and my go-to concealer at the moment, which I want to use up so then I can get through my other ones. I will probably actually repurchase this because it's just amazing. The Urban Decay Naked Skin. I've got my beauty sponge. I've got these palettes. Now, this is my daily highlight palette, which is the Soph palette. Um, but my colleague had a really great idea by doing daily eyeshadow palettes so you use a different eyeshadow palette every day so that your palettes get used up which is such a great idea so i've just got some palettes here that i don't use so often i use this one all the time don't get me wrong it's the reloaded by um is it the reloaded yeah it's the reloaded iconic fever by revolution um but i've got some new palettes that i've got i've got my couple of w7 ones just things i want to try um a lot more often and at the back i've just got a couple of palettes holding this in place so it doesn't slip and slide so much but this will change up um if i get a new foundation for example i'll put this back in this drawer which is my base products now which is looking a bit bare and empty but that's all right um so yeah i am honestly so so happy with how this looks and then quickly this is what my other sort of deep makeup drawer looks like i've just got all my lip products and bits and pieces in here because i'm hardly ever go to these but i do want them obviously so they're staying and my number seven sharpener this is all the max and more makeup products from the pound shop which i will be testing soon in the video so keep your eyes peeled for that i'm so excited to test this mascara because the one looks incredible and then i've just got my glitters and makeup tape and makeup mirror and all that so i'll be filming quite a few makeup looks soon so now all i've got to do is put cotton pads into this um and put that somewhere put jewelry away put my phone cases away i actually know where they're going this is like a box there's a box um that i got with malika like a year ago maybe even longer maybe when we first met up i think it's actually when we first met up two years ago um and i put all my phone cases in here now and i've been using this one that i got so much it's literally beautiful i'm gonna put that back on my phone in a bit um but i'm gonna put this one in here and i'm also going to put this one which i love it says glitter in my veins so i've tested these both on my phone and i love them so so much they can go in there yeah so i'm just gonna put these in the bin so i had to cut into them um and i'm just gonna grab all of this because no oh, that's empty this is all rubbish from me organizing 
um, but we're taking the bins out tomorrow so that won't be full for much longer um so yeah i'm just gonna put this away my colleague is also getting this as i previously mentioned when i actually bought it So I'm also re-watching Riverdale, I've had my couscous, um, but I'm re-watching Riverdale, but the new episode, as I said, has come out, so I'm going to probably watch that tomorrow now, probably tomorrow morning, because I'm feeling a bit delirious right now, um, but I'm on season two, episode one, again, because I just love it. I've decided tomorrow also I'm going to donate my stuff to charity, because it's been easy to be done, and I'm actually going to be getting up early tomorrow, so it shouldn't be a problem, if necessary I can do it on my way to lunch, because... I am going to Pizza Express with Lynn, my grandma, and a really close family friend. Um, but tomorrow I want to get stuff done. I want to have a productive weekend. I feel so positive since passing my maths. I really want to make something of myself and just be productive and not have another slumpy weekend and just get things done and dusted. And I'm not being funny or anything. And I know this might sound so cringy or cheesy, but... Recently things have been really difficult, my, like with my mum, she hasn't been feeling very good, like with her neck and everything. I mentioned in the previous, like, oh my god, the lighting makes me look dead. There we go. Not that it makes much difference, but, you know. Um, with her neck, she hasn't been fantastic, and she's finally got to the place where something's clicked, and it's, like, getting better again. Um, but I've just, and it's just been, like, things with... You know, what happened to my granddad? And, like, missing my granddad has come up quite a bit as well recently. Like, I miss him all the time, but sometimes it gets worse than, other, like, it gets worse sometimes. Um, and I just felt low. So getting the results that I've actually passed something to do with maths is just great. But I'm going to end this vlog here because I need to do a lot of editing tonight and I want to try and get it up all before tomorrow because I want to film my testing video and vlog. So I need the storage. But I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to smash a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you have not already. I am so happy with my makeup collection. And I'm really excited to show you all it. So yeah, I'll see you in my next vlog or video. Whichever one you watch first. Bye.